stop numero dos on my list is this way. Oh yay, my tree grew. That's great. Um. Yeah. All right. So my suspicion was right. That is that area. Um. My only thought is to go up into maybe one of the buildings that I haven't been in. Even though I'm pretty sure I have been in all the buildings. Please tell me I'm not about to die here. <laughs> oh, I should have grabbed another pick. Eh, whatever. This is not Lakalo. Oh, this is where the wool is. That is the wool. Yep, that is definitely where the wool is. I oh man, <laughs> this is a bad idea. Oh god, yep, bad idea. A bunch of creepers and a blaze down here now. Like they're one shots because they took fall damage. All right, bad idea. Then what? Okay, where are you guys coming from? I'm like opening up old wounds here. I don't like this area. I gotta figure out where this intersection is, though. I don't have the slightest clue. Let's break you. How have I not already broken you? Oh? Could this be it? This looks like it. Maybe? No, I don't I don't think so. Looks like there's just a chest, a bunch of anvils in here. Dang it. Uh, uh. Um. Um, I don't know what to think about that. Unbreaking Diamond Sword. What's that place down there? Oh, it looks like that's the, uh. I know where that is. Probably nothing in any of these furnaces. <clears throat> yeah, nothing in them. So this place was a bust, I guess. Yeah, no. Um. Yes, that sword will be left for now. This doesn't seem to lead anywhere either. Hmm. I don't think going up anymore will going up more will actually help me. Um This is gonna be a bad idea. Yep, 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 yep. Bad idea. Bad idea. 
Got that dirt. Huh, where is this at? I might have to Google it, um, or YouTube it, or something, I'm not entirely sure. I'm really hoping it's not in that outer darkness area. Oh, you know, whoa. A lot of stuff, I guess, that spawned while it was up there and fell down. about it there was a there was a place in the uh, outer darkness area that I couldn't get to that I died trying to get to but I'll probably die if I try going there again but I do have feather falling um this time I'm gonna bring my golden apple then just in case so if that's the way you see it you'd think that it's uh in the lower mines part where the next intersection is none of these names really have a hint to uh everforge i feel like wouldn't be it the lower mines i could see being it just because there's all those uh well actually there's rails here too i didn't think about that until just now um because like I was going to say, you'd think that he'd give you, or you'd think because of the rails being here that that would be like his way of uh, giving you a good p way to transport your items back and forth from intersection to intersection. You know, other than the ender chest because there's not a lot of space in an ender chest. It just seems like I'd f I'd see this place already if there, if there wasn't like a place to get here this way. Uh, we'll see. Well, like I was saying, I did see that one area that I couldn't really get to. This place has just been the bane of my existence with the deaths. And I just don't want to go through it again. These are chests over here. I remember this. Wow. Picked up an extra torch and left space for them to spawn. Sorry. I thought that was smart of me. Who am I apologizing to myself? Okay. Sorry, me. Probably should have come in with more carrots. I don't have a lot of food to use up here. I'll wait until I'm missing more hunger to use it, to eat. Okay, over here is how you get there. I can't believe I couldn't figure out how to get out of here. I probably won't be able to figure out how to get out of here actually this time either so let's put that right there so future me sees it yeah you see that big uh, area like in the middle right there that's where the wool is right here and the way you got in is like right here I made that pathway you're seeing right there but there was another section, which I think is that right there, that uh, you could get past, but there was so many, so many skeletons and zombie pigmen. This was off camera, so this is why I'm explaining this to you. There were so many uh, skeletons and zombie pigmen and creepers and stuff, and even zombies. There was just everything was there. <laughs> Pretty much just everything was there. Um, that were all over me, so I just couldn't 
I couldn't. No, I tried jumping off. <laughs> At least get my stuff, my stuff to all like land down here. Nope, didn't work. I died and uh, lost most of my stuff because by the time I could get up there, um, it was all despawned. So maybe this time I should actually try going straight. Well, um, no, I'll just go in the normal way. I was thinking maybe I should just go straight up to it. Which, looking at it, seems to be a really easy solution because it's right there. That baby zombie. Why do I feel like I'm not going the right way here? Because I'm not. I'm going the left way. Right way's over here. Before I started recording, I spent like two or three hours editing a bunch of stuff. So, and uh, clearing out space in my hard drive. It's hard because when you have like an intro that you've made for something that you want to keep, um, you have to make sure that you don't delete the clips that are in that intro for when you can, uh, for when you edit like the next video that uses that intro. You know. Whatever. Over some over simplifier. It was that right? No, that's not it. Is it? I think that's it right there. So I had to build to it. First things first. I want to try breaking this. Break. Okay. <laughs> or is that it? Oh god! I don't know how you got up here. I think that skeleton is trying to make his way up to me. I could just pearl over to it. No, no, no. That's where I just came from. Why am I thinking that that's it? The skeleton just shot at me. From where? Oh, that's him right there. Hardly see in that darkness. I want all these zombie pigmen dead. It's the only way I'm going to be safe here. Alright. I made this walkway right here. I know that for a fact. Okay. Could this be it? Spawners down there. Tons of them. Tons of spawners down here. Um, there's zombie spawners. Oh shit! <laughs> Very nice. I did not see that. Oh god, it's poison too. Get up here. I think I brought that apple, huh? What triggered it? Player detected? Zombies? Okay, this is a problem. Officially. Whoa, 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 Huh. Alright. I seem a bit trapped here. Building it this way so even if spiders come down here, they can't get to me. There we go. This 
trap chests? I don't know. Okay, I thought these zombies wouldn't be such a big deal, but... They're scary. Shit. <laughs> that sucks. Yep, stone pigs are nice and all. They're going away pretty fast though. That poison got me sh right on that first time. I have absorption, I thought I had. Got me there too. Should probably dig to it. Get it out of there. I know how these work. There's a uh, baby spawner or baby spider on a rail cart. That looks like a trap chest, I think. I don't really know what. Like, what's the what's the point of getting down here? Is there some epic loot? Or is this just pointless? I mean, there's gotta be something, right? With all these spawners, you'd think there's gotta be something. I mean, zombie spawners especially. Come on, woodpick, don't fail me now! If I actually get these all lit up, I can combat them. Otherwise, it'd be very hard. Stick around them some more until I get a better feel of what's, you know, past them. Um, let's see. See, is this safe right here? If I break this open. Let's start killing them, I guess. Hi there, little guy. Let's not forget that little ones can get through here. Alright. Running a tad low on, on my food. And blocks. Ooh, really low on blocks, actually. Because these are all slabs, not full blocks. That would be why. Dang it. So one of these. I'm gonna have a, about like as little confrontation with all of these mobs as possible. 